it's always so quiet in the mornings. <laughs> Good morning, guys. Just finishing up my makeup and getting ready for the day. And then I will get in my gym fit. Today I'm working legs. I think I'm gonna wear shorts. Plus I have like fresh self tanner on, so I'm feeling real good. Definitely wanna wear shorts today. And I might be getting a new Gymshark package soon, which is always really fun to like pick a new outfit out. But let's go through and see what we can find. Good morning. I'm just gonna climb into my little tiny chair here. And honestly, I am kind of like writing down my things of what to do in my journal, not journal, like planner. And then I'm also inputting it into Monday. So let me show you. I just use Monday, which also helps me manage everything. So I have like my app goals, my personal goals, which I write down everything like podcast episodes, the Instagram podcast. And so I just kind of go through. For me, that's really nice because I can go through and put everything down digitally and electronically. That way I'm really not missing any beats or anything, but sometimes it's really quick for me just to jot everything down, my first priorities. And when it comes to this planner, I feel like I've already shown you guys i feel like i've already kind of shown you but basically it's just like quick tick tasks projects and then kind of trying to time block so i'm just trying to get organized this morning it's almost 8 a.m and Vinny's still asleep and i am so hungry so i'm gonna go and make breakfast and he might wake up soon so we're gonna head to the kitchen make breakfast i think i'm just gonna make avocado toast but my avocados might be bad so we'll see we'll see sourdough the only way to go i swear by sourdough it's like the best bread I love it. Giant egg pancake and Vinny's away. I just know this avocado is gonna be bad, but I'm gonna be hopeful. Let's see if any of this is salvageable. <gasps> okay, enough of this is salvageable. That just makes me so happy. Not much, but some better than I thought. Vinny has one egg, and then a little bit of toast. I'm also having a bowl of berries and now I'm gonna start getting to work. Okay, so it's now time to pick a gym fit. I, again, like I said, I wanna wear shorts. I definitely want my butt to look good. Guys, I picked my gym fit. Ah, aquamarine vibe, literally so freaking cute so this is a new bandeau from gymshark and i was like i wonder if i have a pair of shorts to match it and i'm so glad i keep like all my old stuff because it perfectly matches this old pair of flex shorts which i'm just dying for like look at the little aqua so cool today's gym fit vibes i am so stoked to go to the gym I've been having a little bit of anxiety today. Sometimes on Mondays, I just feel so overwhelmed because like this past week, I took Saturday and Sunday fully off. So when I come back on Monday, I'm like, oh shoot, like I have so much to do. And I'm like, why do I do that to myself? But I'm just trying to breathe through it. We're gonna go to the gym, start a day with a good workout, good sweat, and then get back to our work. Also, I'm so stoked about the event this weekend. So I need to like finalize all of the plans and events for that. So, so much to look forward to. And it's also not super cold today, which I love. So. Okay, it's pre-workout time. Gotta get my cup and my straw. I love this. And sometimes I'll just put it in like the mini shaker too, but let's do this. This morning I already took my probiotic, but I want to show you because genuinely you guys, I freaking love this probiotic. I'm almost out actually, but I have a second container, thank goodness. It's Beam's new probiotic and it's cool because I've already taken, been taking a probiotic and the fact that like Beam has come out with one that I love and it works so well for my digestion, I'm like, let's go. I'm so stoked. So that's what I take. I, I almost grabbed the stim free, but I definitely want caffeine this morning for my workout. I've got to do sour blue gummy. Not only because it's my favorite, but it also matches today's gym fit. So that's what I'm gonna be pulling out. But yeah, I'm obsessed with this new probiotic. Like I've skipped it a couple days by accident and I'm like, mm, no, like this is just something that I don't wanna skip in my daily routine and I love it so much. So if you guys are also looking for a probiotic, I cannot recommend Beam's gut health probiotic enough. Also my counter is still a little bit messy from breakfast. So I probably need to clean that up okay we've got one scoop i love this stuff so freaking much it's my favorite flavor and i like to add ice so that it's cold i love a cold pre-workout drink it just makes it so much just the best i mean look how cute it matches are we kidding so cute now 
Oh shoot, I don't have a place to put you. And how about this? You guys! Okay, I'm at the gym now. Almost during all my pre. I just love to sip on it as I drive over. I don't know, I just feel so fancy. It's just part of the process. It's part of my routine. And you guys know how important I'm always like, routine, routine, have it, stick with it. I just had to take my daily gym pick of the shoe, my like leggings or shorts, and then my pre-workout. Like I do that every single day and post on Instagram. Had to do that. Let me show you, let me show you, let me show you. Also, fire pick. Oh, there it is. There it is. Guys, real quick before I go oh. to the gym. Oh. Like, oh, go inside. Oh. No, no, no. Okay, so, listen, I'm actually not, like, a blue gal, but this blue is just serving today. This blue is everything. I am so freaking excited about this Houston event. Like, I am feeling so grateful to be able to work with two brands that I absolutely love. I love working with Gymshark, you guys know. I have loved Gymshark since the beginning of my fitness journey, since 2019, since 2018, when I first started. I love Gymshark, and... This is a full circle moment for me. I'm so grateful to be able to be working with them. Second is Beam. I, like if I'm gonna be, I'm just gonna be straight. Like if I'm gonna be endorsing or being with a brand, I love to be with a brand that gives back. And that is my favorite thing about Beam is like they are focusing on giving back when they can, where they can and helping always give like proceeds and donating. That means a lot to me to be able to be with a company that like cares about helping other people instead of like just making money where I get it, it's a business, but I love Beam for that reason and I love their products. I am just a huge fan and they're such a new company. I feel like not a lot of people know about them. So I'm just like really happy to be able to work with them and like spread people to take their supplements because I love it. I love their freaking probiotic. I take that every morning. It makes me feel so good. And I was like, I feel like my digestion, everything is fine before, but I, since taking it, I'm like, I feel even better now. And I'm like, this is so cool. And I love their protein. It's so clean. Like it doesn't make me feel sick or anything. And I love my pre work now. Okay. I'm just feeling really grateful for being able to be supported by two companies that I love and be able to support them back. That's enough of that. So I'm going to head in to the gym. We're hitting legs today. I'm not sure if I'm just going to be like vlogging it for TikTok and Instagram, like getting footage or if I'm going to do any for YouTube. We'll see what I got. And yeah, let's head to the gym and let's get this lift. Bye. Yo, all right, so listen up everybody. Here's the snitch. So as you guys know, I'm redoing my office if you watched the latest YouTube video, but maybe you didn't, maybe you didn't, I don't know. And look, these are little blobs that my mom got Vinny. So this is Vinny's favorite place in the house. I don't know what these angles are, but like just welcome to my house, welcome to my vlog. Maybe I'll like go like this, is this better? I'm still like a pinhead, I don't know what's going on. Let's just give a little bit of an update. Let me put you on something though, so that like we can actually chat. In the last video, First of all, yeah, I got a hatch alarm. You all know I freaking love that. If you follow me on Instagram, I'm like always posting about it. I love the hatch alarm. I love my hatch alarm. That thing, okay, let me talk about it. First of all, the alarm goes off at 5.30, right? And I have the alarm be, it's like this little sunrise. And then my little birds are chirping. Darian kind of hates the birds because the birds are kind of like, wait, 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 wait. 
I'm like, bro, I need to turn that thing down to like volume two because they are kind of chirping, yapping a little bit too much at me. It was a little bit vicious sometimes, but that's okay. That's okay. That's beside the point. So the alarm is up at 5.30, right? But at five, this thing slowly starts to get brighter and brighter. And every day, 15 minutes before my alarm. So my alarm is supposed to go off at 5.30, but 5.15, I'm like, yo, what's that bright light? And it's my little hatch alarm. Just say, what's that? Hello. So I'm awake before the birds even chirp. Except one morning I was really out and the birds did wake me up. But I'm like, oh, this is a natural wake up. Like, let's go for the day. And it's so hard because, listen, the room is dark. Darian loves dark rooms. He is like, not a light is shining. I hate, he hates light in the room. Like, I get it. Like, he has a very stressful profession. So like he loves it to be pitch black in the room. And I'm always like, I can't sit in a thing. And so it's hard for me to wake up in the morning. It's just hard. Cause it's dark and it's cold and it doesn't get sunny. Like this is like one of the first sunny days I've had in a while. Don't even get me started about seasonal depression, you guys. I talked about that on my podcast, like good night, that thing sucks. So yeah, anyways, I love this hatch alarm. Follow up from the previous video before this. Now, this video is just like literally just chit chat, which I like. I'm just, I'm posting it because I want to talk to you guys. That's what I want to do. And so what was I literally saying? Following through, oh, I have so many updates. Wait, I have so many updates that are fun. So last video, update on the hatch alarm, check, like update on the office, kind of coming along, which is really cool and fun. The third thing is I, okay, I almost got my workout split completely figured out. I'm just really trying to like nail it down. And then also I'm trying to do another workout, like a new program, strength program. So I'm literally trying to write that out and figure out how to progressively have that move from week to week. And it's just taking me a little bit longer because it kind of keeps just falling on the back of the wheel. Like I ain't gonna lie. Okay, I'm working on that one. But with that being said, I did a cycle class. Like so much has been going on that has benefited me. Like I have been having a hard couple weeks. That time of the month came by and genuinely has completely thrown me for a loop. I have really, really been struggling. Like I'm openly saying that because it has been tough, so tough on me mentally. Like I'm just have not been really in a good place and I'm finally feeling like better and better and better. So I went to the cycling class and like I legit am sitting there and I'm like, wow, first of all, the biggest feeling of fulfillment because a, I've been struggling, B, I showed up for myself and I was so proud of myself for being in there. Like I got emotional, like the first two rides, I legit was like so happy, teary eyed, and I'm up there, I'm spinning, I'm cranking my legs like this. And she's like, I don't even know the terminology. Like I, I felt a little bit lost, but I don't care. I was so proud of myself for showing up and being there. I was emotional and I was teary eyed. Maybe it was sweat, it was tears. And I was like, I cannot believe I just showed up. Like I can't believe I did this. I'm so proud of myself for coming here. This is such a big win for me. And like that just feeling of, I'm showing up for myself, I'm keeping these promises that I set out to do. There is so much confidence and power in that. I cannot express that to you. Like I want you to feel that way. I want you to experience that so much because it was cool as I was filming that video, I was like, wow, I did this. Like I started practicing my handstands. Amazing, I feel amazing doing that. Two, I scheduled that cycling class, actionable item. I did it, like I made that actionable item. I took that step. I feel so good taking a new class and trying new things. I went to the tumbling place. I tried my front handspring that I haven't done since forever. And I was like, wow, there's a sense of accomplishment and sense of fulfillment that comes from that and doing what I say I'm gonna do. It's only built my confidence and I've just been feeling so amazing because of that. Even though I've been sad due to hormones and just, I've been real, real sad, but like these moments and I'm like, wow, like things are good. Like take, take a chill. Like we're, we're doing good. And I, I just want to share that with you because like, that's cool for me. That's a huge win for me. So that's really just the chit chat that I wanted to share. And, um, that's today's little update. I feel really happy and I'm constantly trying to do better and improve and I love taking you guys along with that. And I'm gonna now get back to work and maybe switch out my desk and see if I really like it. You guys, I hate it.
That's the official end of today's video. I hope you guys liked it. It was a little bit of stuff from recent as well as last week. I just kind of wanted to throw everything in a vlog that I had already filmed, even though a little bit more of a random weekly vlog, but I hope you guys enjoyed it. And next video needs to be my updated workout split that is coming. I'm also headed to Houston, so I'm really excited to vlog that. And with that being said, if you haven't already, make sure you like this video, subscribe to my channel. You can follow me on TikTok, Instagram, listen to the podcast every Wednesday, train with me on my new app. And I'll see you guys in the next video. Bye.